Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is George Galloway asking for your support in the by-election on the 29th of February. We're going to fight for respect for Rochdale. We're going to ensure that people can be proud again to say they come from Rochdale. The town of Gracie Field, the town that was once a byword in England for a proud northern town. Nowadays people claim to be from Manchester rather than Rochdale. The genocide in Gaza. And that's what we are fighting for. For the poor children and women under bombardment in Gaza, hungry, visited by disease and squalor as a deliberate act of policy by Western governments and their ally Israel. And the British government and the Labour Party are deeply involved in the crimes being committed against the Palestinian children in Gaza. The weapons that are raining down on those children are given to Israel by Western countries, including our own, and with the full support of Labour. For Rochdale, for Gaza and for Rochdale, then you have the chance to do it on the 29th of this month. It's a by-election that will change everything. It will make history. It will make Rochdale great again. If you have any questions, please come to the door. I'll be delighted to meet you and to answer them. My team are here, knocking on doors, delivering leaflets, and engaging with the voters. George Galloway, 29th of February, the by-election in Rochdale. The by-election that will take place here in Rochdale, but which will be noticed all over the country and all over the world. We're asking you to boycott Labour to punish them for all the things of which they are guilty, both here and Rochdale and abroad. We're asking you not to do the same old, same old, because then you'll be guaranteed to get the same old, same old. It's time for change. It's time for hope. It's time for the community to use their voting power to change things for the better. George Galloway asking for your support on the 29th of this month in a by-election that will be noticed all over the world. It will be noticed here in Rochdale first and foremost because it will break the Labour stranglehold that has choked this town almost half to death. It will be noticed across Greater Manchester, across the north. It will encourage them in Birmingham, in London. It will encourage people all over this country to know that voting can change things and that keeping the same old politicians in power will change nothing at all. Oh, but it will be noticed not just across this country but across other countries too. It will be a by-election that will be remembered for ever. George Galway, there. They are asking you more. Kaya, one, sorry, Kola. You know, I mean, you have to vote, you know.
उसने कीमत बनाओ यू नो मीन की मेक इट योर वैल्यू मेक अ वैल्यू टू योर वर्क वेस्ट ना करो या द वेस्ट बिकॉज़ व्हाट्स हैपनिंग इज स्पेशली द लेबर काउंसलर्स और द लेबर पीपल हु आर गोइंग अराउंड स्पेशली व्हेन दे बीन सैक्ड एज़ वेल दे बीन सैक्ड दे सेल्फ एंड दे आस्किंग मी फॉर देयर वर्क व्हिच पर्सन गेट्स सैक्ड फ्रॉम अ जॉब आई सेड गो वर्क फॉर दैट कंपनी इट इज एब्सोल्युटली स्टूपिड दीस गाइस नॉकिंग इट वाज टेकिंग इट फॉर ग्रांटेड and he is thomas taking it for granted as well because he's thinking what's the point because the muslims will go around with the counselors the chronic counselors the idiots and go try get worse please don't be fooled by the idiots i want for galloway bring a change and make sure that what is theos got valued i say we need that thank yeah. you very much alakala thank you very much see the youngsters go around knocking on people's door asking for support for george galloway they doing a really good job mashallah Or Hasan How's it going? Everything good, good yeah? Alhamdulillah. Choose find the panel. Come on, chop chop. Come on. Choose the door. Come on. Election on the 20th of February. Choose. A violation. Choose the door. Choose Color it a little bit. <laughs> so you get to take up. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Rochdale, the most talked about town in Britain, and not just in Britain. You'll be sending a message across the world that war and the cruel, brutal oppression of the women and children of Gaza is rejected here. and by millions of right thinking people everywhere it will shake the british political class to their foundations and they'll have to change their tune that's what we want we want to make rochdale great again a place to be proud of god bless all in scarfe that's a very good name scarfe Nice for hide out there. We will support you, we will support you. Good place to get lost. Inshallah. Inshallah. Okay. Good luck. On the best. And all that thing. Oh, thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. you're doing all the services and helping them and supporting them so yeah, I agree, yeah. you know it's it's tough times at the moment yeah, you know it is a very tough time for the people you love the yeah. you okay yeah yeah, yeah. 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 george galloway's in town yeah. Yeah. don't worry about him it's good hi hello how you doing hello mrs hello. i'm 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 here for my prescription 
How are you, Mr. Joy? You okay? Nice to see you. Thank you very much for coming. How long have you been here? We are here for the last seven years. And maybe we be born. Thank you. Definitely here. And it's a great pleasure to see you here. Thank you, sir. God bless you. God bless you, man. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. When should, when should it be ready? Thank you, Thank you very much. Thanks. Thanks. Yeah. 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 Because those people that believe in justice, those people that believe in humanity, they have no colour. And those that don't, they have nothing but darkness in their heart. And we are reminded of that because there are many good people who have that darkness in their heart. And that has no ethnicity, that has no religion, that has no gender. So let's remind ourselves that this is what the dirty politics of this country and beyond are doing. And now in order to bring people together, we've had some fantastic meetings and gatherings. And on that note, I want you to welcome the man who's going to make it happen. We started to see the tremors. Let's see a little bit more. A big warm welcome to George Galloway! I'm truly humbled by so many of the things that have been said here today. Yes, about me and my work over half a century. Don't tell my wife, she thinks I'm 45. <laughs> but by, above all, our brother, the doctor from Gaza, with more names on the back, of his flag than you were able to count. The names of his murdered family members in Gaza. And he's here amongst us in Rochdale and on this platform today. We've heard such powerful words about the Palestinian children, all to Zionism and to the criminals that I have ever seen. But we, we here, and we in the Workers' Party, and you here, all of you in Rochdale, we have nothing to apologize for. And by the way, we're not just calling for a ceasefire. A ceasefire is necessary but not sufficient. Shafiq and I have seen many ceasefires only for the fire to begin again. We are not just calling for a ceasefire. We are calling for victory to the Palestinian people in their struggle to be free. And we will do anything, everything to assist them in that struggle. We need to boycott Israel. Britain after a long life there, parents. As Shanaz said, I myself have also been present at many births. Everybody here who has, and especially every woman here who has given birth, knows the difficulties of labor. Imagine the agony, not just of the mothers, but their mothers, their husbands, as 20,000 children have been born in Gaza, mashallah, in the last 127 days. They are never going to wipe out the Palestinian people. We will not allow them to wipe out the Palestinian people. God will not allow them to wipe out the Palestinian people. But the suffering has been immense. 30,000 dead, 
70% of them women and children. Imagine 10,000 children annihilated in 127 days. And to add insult to that injury, that ocean of injuries, that ocean of blood, our politicians have been cheering it on from the sidelines, have been apologizing for it, have been explaining it, and above all have been arming it and funding it. And we've got one young man who's going to talk about the alliance and the work that's been done across Rochdale. Usman Nawaz, my brother, he'll talk to you about Rochdale Community Alliance. I hope I've got that right. It's fantastic to see so many people here turn out. This genocide in Gaza has really been an awakening for not just Muslims and people of Rochdale, but right across the world. And this should be a political awakening as well. We absolutely feel solidarity with the people of Palestine.